It was a rude awakening in a Pinellas County neighborhood. A homeowner opened fire overnight, shooting a suspected burglar in North Reddington Beach. We're told the suspect was met with gunfire after trying to smash his way into a home on Bath Club Boulevard North. That's where we find Fox 13's Evan Moon tonight. Evan, I know you spoke with neighbors. Uh, they just must have been shocked by all of this. They were. Neighbors tell me he actually tried to break into multiple houses, including the one behind me. That's where he was shot. Uh, the wife was actually asleep on the couch when he broke the glass right next to the front door and barreled in towards her. Uh, neighbors here heard the gunshot. They heard screams. I stood in my driveway with my gun in case he came towards me. Yeah. But he didn't. A North Reddington Beach neighborhood is shaken after a man targeted multiple homes on Bath Club Boulevard. Around 3 a.m., he used a rock to smash through the pane of glass by the front door of one home, where a husband and wife were asleep. The wife was on the couch when she saw the man barrel towards her. One neighbor saw a lot of it unfold. Then he picked up a, a loose big rock over there and um, broke into Randy and Sherry's house. She happened to be uh, sleeping on the couch because she couldn't sleep. And he got a hold of her and she's yelling for Randy. And Randy came out and shot the guy. After he was shot near the shoulder, they say, he ran directly across the road to another home and tried smashing a second window. Those residents tell me they woke up to the gunshot noise and moments later heard what sounded like an explosion at their front door. Luckily, the man couldn't get in, police arriving shortly after. Both homeowners spent the morning cleaning blood and glass from their front porches. They say he seemed under the influence. They couldn't calm him down because when he was crazy on drugs and and the pain from his shoulder but they finally uh, they got him in an ambulance and took him away in 55 years here uh, we've had uh, I don't know of any crime because you got to be stupid to break in here you're on a cul-de-sac you can't get away now, the man shot doesn't have any life-threatening injuries. Uh, police have not determined if there was any sort of motive or if he was under the influence of any substances. The neighbors here obviously shaken but unharmed. Linda? Yeah, and that is the good news. Evan, thank you.